this place. If you have not been here before, I would like for you to like, comment, and subscribe. Just leave me a little heart in the uh, description box. If you have been here, I welcome you back. Today, I'm going to be cooking a tomahawk steak. And uh, I have some seasonings that I'm going to put on the tomahawk steak. I have washed the steak off, and now I'm patting it dry. And the seasonings we're going to put on the steak is, uh, let me get a spoon. Will be the steak seasonings. I'm going to put two teaspoons in. Chicago steaks, steak. One, two, three. Let me put three in, cause it's a big old steak. And two teaspoons of holy garlic. and two teaspoons of onion butter. I'm gonna mix it up. And we're gonna put these seasonings on the steak and I'm gonna heavy season this steak. How about the garlic, uh, the uh, olive oil? The avocado oil. I forgot about it. But you put your avocado on, uh, oil on before you start seasoning the steak. But I'm going to turn it over like this and do the other side. Like that. The reason why I'm putting the olive oil on, but so it'll stick to the meat. All on the sides. I'm flipping it back over like this and rubbing it in the sides, on the sides. I'm going to put the rest of it on it. And I'm going to get my frying pan out. To sear the seasonings into the steak. Next, I'm going to put two teaspoons of olive oil in the pan. I'm going to drop the steak in the grease, and I'm going to sear the steak for five minutes per side on medium. Next, five minutes on the other side. There goes the steak, and um, we are going to take them over there and put them on the little foil. I'll be right back. We have got to place the steak on the foil and wrap it up this way and then take the foil and go this way. I must have got, I, I need some more foil. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Let me get some more foil. Let 
we're gonna wrap the steak up real, real tight. And I have this uh, casserole dish, and I'm gonna put it in the casserole dish. And it may cook uh, one hour or one and a half hour. I'll be right back. On 350. I'm gonna let it rest for 20 minutes and I will be back. I'm going to make the gravy. You need uh, two tablespoons of avocado oil. How about three? And next we're gonna add three tablespoons of oil. About a teaspoon full. medium between low and medium the steak has been resting here for 20 minutes Pour the gravy that came off the steak in the pan. And it's on medium. Once 
once the gravy gets thick, I'm gonna put it back on medium. I had it up high to start the boiling. Between low and medium. You will start laying the meats in the gravy. And you will turn it down low and let the gravy marinate with the meat. The meat is on low and it's simmering. And you will have to add a pot to the meat, to the pan. Add a sprig of rosemary to the meat and the sauce. 